And that's right, Philip. It is a very emotional and somber ceremony here for LAPD officer Fernando Arroyos. As you said, hundreds of officers, friends, and family are here to say goodbye. Now, let's go to a live picture of what is happening at this moment. Just a short while ago, we heard from LAPD police chief Michael Moore. Now we're listening to the mayor of Los Angeles, Eric Garcetti. Now, the family says that Arroyos had two dreams in life. One was to be the first person in his family to go to college. He did that by graduating from UC Berkeley with honors. His second dream was to become an LAPD officer, and he did that as well. The 27-year-old was shot and killed during an attempted robbery in Walnut Park on January 10th. Police say he was off duty at the time and was house hunting with his girlfriend when the suspects pulled up in a pickup truck. There was some sort of argument to steal something. Shots were fired. Now, four people have been arrested in connection with that shooting death. Arroyos was a three-year veteran of the department and was assigned to the Olympic Station. The chief says he was just beginning his career and wanted to make his community a better place. Our deepest condolences, our heartfelt sorrow. We join you in this grievous moment. Thank you for the privilege to stand here today. I know my words will be inadequate, but I will try to relay to you the love and support of the entire Los Angeles Police Department. And you can hear there a very emotional moment for the chief of police. Arroyos, meanwhile, is survived by his girlfriend, mother, and stepfather. The family recently had also lost his grandmother.